So this question says for the function q, the value of q of x decreases by 45% for every increase in the value of x by 1. Hmm. Okay, so as x goes up by 1, q of x goes down by 45%. If q of 0 equals 14, okay, q of 0 is equal to 14, which equation defines q? So I'm going to use this first to see if I can cancel anything out here, and then I'll deal with how to use this stage here. So this here is telling me that when x is 0, q of 0 should be 14. So if I put a 0 here, this whole thing will become 1, 0.5 time times 1. That's not equal to 14, so choice A is gone. Same thing would happen here. This all would become 1. That's 1.45. 1 That's not 14, so choice B is gone. But it looks like choices C and D would give me the 14 that I want, right? Because this becomes 1. 14 times 1 works. Of course, this 0 and 1, so same thing. So Q and C, or sorry, C and D are good answers. Let me just erase this for now. All right, so the next thing I'm going to do is use this idea so i know that then q of 1 should be 14 minus 14 times 0.45 right so 45 percent less than or i could have just said 55 percent of 0.4 or 55 percent of 14. either way i get the same exact answer so i'm gonna go to my calculator and type in 14 times 0.55 that's equal to 7.7 .7. so i know that q of 1 should equal 7.7 .7. So then let's see, out of these two that are left, I can see the answer already, right? If I put a 1 here, then 0 0.55 time, 0 0.55 to the first power is 0.55. And I just did the math on this. 14 times 0.55 is equal to 7.7. .7. That is exactly what I wanted to see. I will not get that here. In fact, I'll get an increase of 45%. So choice C must be the correct answer.